Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Pops and Doxies with myself Michelle and myself Jasper. And today we have two more mail calls, one from uh, oldschooltoys.nl and one from Tiny Titan. And these are mostly pops from my collection, some of them for Jasper's collection. Yep. And we have a specialty or little item about and it's a collection, Jasper, recently. Yeah. It's the completion of the, the holiday series, yeah. the Krampus uh, series uh, from Funko. So we'll be ending with, uh, with that. But first we have uh, our small mill hall from yeah, Old School, Old School Toys. Toys. And they most, they, you know, they sell a lot of pops, but also uh, pops with the exclusive stickers. So Target stickers, box launch. Hot topic, everything you can imagine. And one of them is a spastic plastic from Funko itself with the Funko Shop uh, sticker. And this one is designed by Tanner Hedges. There was a design contest, and he won contest by designing bad boy and fantastic plastic are the I think they were bobble heads I'm not sure but they were the original characters that Funko created before they started the Funkos so I really like this one I love bats and I think it's really cute so I had to order the bad boy and the next pop we ordered is one with the original sticker. Uh, another one from the Venomized series. It's the LA Comic Con Corrupted Venom Glow in the Dark. Yeah, really awesome. Yeah, it's a great pop. Uh, there also is a common one that isn't glow in the dark. Uh, Old School Toys was uh, one of the few shops who uh, sold it with the original LA Comic Con sticker. So I was glad, very um, glad that I could find it over there. Yeah, obviously it's more expensive than the exclusive stickers. But for him, it's worth it. He really likes the original stickers. Yeah, yeah. so it's a, it's a great addition to the, the Venomized series. Uh, and I really hope I'm uh, completing this one. Although I already saw that uh, with Funk Queen coming up in, in September, there are already a few more new additions to, uh, to this series. If I'm correct, it's the, the, the Kingpin Venomized version and the Jack O'Lantern which um, is completely Halloween style, of course, uh, also a Venomized version. Um, so I'll be looking forward to get those uh, when they are uh, available, hopefully with uh, the right stickers. Not sure if Funkoween is getting uh, its own sticker. Uh, but still we haven't we... seen it so far. Nope. It's All just the a... items that were presented didn't have any Funkoween sticker. No, but maybe later on when they uh, uh, present the, the pops themselves because they're all pre-orders for September or October this year. Uh, maybe they have some stickers. Maybe they don't and they just will be special edition exclusives or maybe Hot Topic, Entertainment Earth, uh, Pop in a Box, you name it. Yeah. Uh, those sort of shops, exclusives. So we'll have, to, uh, we'll have to see. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and they also sent candy. I don't know if you guys know it over, <clears throat> over in the US or Canada, it's Haribo. Which is a German brand of candy. Gummy bears. Yeah. Another one I bought is also a Funko Shop exclusive, which is El Diablo. I think this is one of the, uh, the pops that used to be a uh, Wacky Wobble yeah, or Yeah, you see it on the back. And it made it into a Funko Pop. I really like this one. Yeah, especially with the, the uh, 20 years anniversary sticker, I think it was one of the first Wacky Wobblers bobbleheads they, uh, they created in uh, 1998. Yeah. yeah. Is, it, is it the first one? I'm not sure. Probably. I it's, think it's, it's one, the first one. It's one of the earlier yeah. ones. And they have more drawings of this one with a black suit and a blue suit, all sorts of suits. And as a last one, also for your collection, it's the Bullseye Funko Shop exclusive. Flocked one from Toy Story. Yeah, so cute. I love flocked ones, so I'm a sucker for flocked. When I see a flocked one that fits my collection, I immediately buy it. And the 
thing that was the most striking to me is that the pop itself, even though it's flocked, it has little stripes in the flocked, in the flocking, I don't know how you call it. Mm -hmm. So it's really detailed. So yeah, this one is for my Toy Story collection. Together with Rex? Yeah. Great don't pack. Have a great number of Toy Story pops yet, but I'm getting there. I think that uh, those are the best characters. Maybe Slinky Dog. Yeah, I also want Slinky. Obviously, because look at this. <laughs> <laughs> Duxies are Slinky, so I have to have it eventually. So this one was the old school toys part. Yeah. And right. next we have the Tiny Titan. Yeah. Dot .be part. Yeah, it's, I think it's all... No, not everything is DC, but it's a pretty big part. So it's for my Batman collection. Yep. Hey guys! Uh, this part is about the holiday collection from Funko. Uh, it mainly contains, uh, in my case, the Krampus. Uh, Krampus is an Austrian uh, Christmas baddie. Uh, takes away the children who have been bad all year long. Um, it also takes away grown-ups, if I'm correct. Oh, sure, I know it scares the crap out of children. Yeah. Obviously, I mean, look at them. And in Austria, um, if I'm correct, they also have parades with all sorts of people dressed as Krampuses, yeah. walking around with uh, bunches of sticks and they scare people and children away. So uh, I think it's, it's a very uh, national thing, uh, although there have been some movies about Krampus of course. Uh, I think last year or maybe two years ago a movie called Krampus uh, came out again. I don't know, could be. I know there was a movie, I don't know how long ago it was. Mm -hmm. And these, there are six pops in this holiday collection. So we are missing one. Yep. And that's the one we'll be opening today. It's the latest, the last one I need for my collection. It's the chase version of the normal one. Uh, this one is just Different color. Uh, colored red. Yeah. While uh, the other pops are the common one, the exclusive one, if I'm correct, it's a white version that uh, in the US is exclusive to uh, FYE. Then we have the Hot Topic Fox variant, and we have the Hot Topic Fox variant, uh, which white. is the Chase version, yeah. so it's the white version. And last but not least, it's the one that came out uh, two years ago, if I'm correct. Yeah, this one's the newest, yeah. I think. Yeah, it's the one with the child in the backpack. Yeah, it's from 2019. Yeah, so two years ago. It's a really heavy pop. Yeah, um, yeah so this is the Krampus collection. Um, yeah, just a little update. Finally complete this was set. Um, and if we have more sets to complete or other mail halls, we'll let you guys know. Thank you for watching. Bye bye. Good things.